facility there that they're releasing a few change rooms and all that sort of stuff. And they've had a fair bit of stuff. All right, so we've got Aaron Fabian here, captain of the Hawks, the yep. Sandgate Hawks, of course, <laughs> not the Hawthorne Hawks. Anyway, yeah. how are you going, mate? Uh, pretty good, feeling fresh. Doing all right? Yeah. So what have you been working on out there? Uh, just mainly our structures, making sure they're uh, ready to go, especially for round one, because uh, it's not that far away, and we definitely want to be at 100% before we start. So. And you mentioned yourself, you're just um, coming back from a bit of an injury. Yeah, yeah uh, just a lower back injury and a um, bit of whiplash. I was in a bit of a car crash three days before Christmas last year, but I'm all good now, so it's good. Feeling better? What's the recovery process been like for you? Uh, there was a lot of rest, uh, a lot of physio, and a whole lot of stretching. Bit of PlayStation as well? A lot of Xbox, yes. <laughs> Very much Fantastic. so. So um, you've been out there training with the guys. Anyone in particular burning it up? or? Um, not really anyone in particular. Uh, there, there are certain groups of players here that uh, have been here for a long time and their, uh, their standards are making the young fellas come up at another level or two, which is still good to see. So hopefully if, that, if those boys keep on improving the young and the young boys can see that, you know, uh, followers lead, um, follow leaders. So if the leaders are doing the right job, you know, um, young fellas also will learn something. And what's it, what's it like being, a, being the captain of the Sandgate Hawks? Uh, for me personally, it's uh, quite a big thing. I've been, a, I've been a part of this club since I was, you know, uh, born really. Uh, my whole family played here. Uh, played all my juniors, played a um, coach at, at that stage back in the day, Bomber, gave me a start in seniors when I was 15, so um, it's been one of my dreams was to play 100 games here and and be a senior agro captain too. It's pretty amazing that you've been able to do that, to come right up from juniors <laughs> and, and, and now be captaining the club. Yeah, it's uh, something I hold quite dearly to myself and um, my family does too. Fantastic. And I saw, um, we, we spoke about earlier about how kind of lucky you guys are in terms of facilities here to be able to train on a, on a second oval and <laughs> yeah. that type of thing. Yeah, we've got this, a few. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it is handy. Um, you know, we've got to, at the end of the day, we've still got to take care of the big girl that everyone plays on. But, you know, to have a backup one with lots and everything like that, they can easily have, fit a team or two teams on it. Um, you know, it does its job. Now, what, what have you focused on as an individual in, in the pre-season? I mean, obviously you've had your rehab, but as yep. a player, is there anything else that you've looked at? Um, to be honest, not really, just my leadership. Um, I feel like my, how vocal I am can improve a lot of things and uh, just, you know, players know where they've got to be and stuff like that. So instead of them out there being lost, I can tell them where they've got to be if, if they are lost and they move to that posse and then you know, hopefully they'll start finding the footy from there. Fantastic. And um, you got Danny, I guess, uh, you know, you've, you've played a lot of a lot of younger players throughout the last season. You'd yeah. probably be looking to do the same again, I'd imagine. Who are some of the younger guys that you enjoy playing with? Uh, a couple of the young fellas, uh, probably one of the guys by the name of Pacho. Uh, he's a young fella. He's, he played mostly Colts last year. He's, uh, he's got a good size body on him for a, for a little fella. But he's also got a good leap and a good kick, so he usually plays up forward, which is good. Um, a couple of the other young fellas, oh, there's too many to count, to be honest with you. <laughs> there's, um, there's, a, there's a whole heap. You know, you got uh, young Harding, who's stepping up. You've got young Jake O'Halloran, who's, um, you know, he's a big, tall rig up in the forward line, so hopefully he might be fighting for a spot in the ones throughout the year as well. Hopefully clunk a couple down there. Oh, let's hope so. <laughs> All right, it's been really good to talk to you and all the best for round one. No, thank you very much. Cheers.